This is Michael Jelly Hamadri Reviews, and today we're doing a review on this Magellan desk over here. Um, it's made by Real De Real Space. Um, the it's called the Magellan, and there are a few different models. Um, I will post in the description the model, and I have bought a mat for my chair that has wheels, so it helps to have a mat. Although it still doesn't really do such a great job, it still works. Um, let's go through the desk. Um, first, I'll give you my opinion on the actual desk. Uh, this desk retails at about 650, okay, or something like that, with the hutch, obviously. Um, it is not worth 650. I ended up paying about 150 dollars for both of them, and that's why it was worth it at the end of the day with you know all my coupons and stuff like that. But honestly, I would not recommend it for anything more than 200. Um, and I'll tell you why. Uh, I don't know if you can see here, but this desk is actually. Uh, very, very low quality. Um, that scratch probably came from me dropping my keys on it. I've got multiple scratches here. Um, I put this pad on it so that way when I work um, or do any work of any kind, um, it would protect it. It's actually a gun mat, but it works perfectly for what I need it for, so that's awesome. Um, I already set everything up on my desk uh, different, you know, and I actually built this myself. It took two hours with two people. Um, it has a cutout here. You're supposed to put the, you know, a, a screen here, but um, I liked it better here. Also, this is where the keyboard is. Um, I guess we could start with the keyboard. Why not? Um, it does not roll in and out nicely. I have put a WD-40 on it already. The last part of it, rolling it out, is actually very hard. Um, yeah. Now, I like to keep my mouse on the, um, right here. Uh, there is not enough space for both a mouse and a keyboard, and this is a tiny keyboard, by the way, and it does not fit the mouse nicely, um, so just letting you know. Um, this is made out of a, I don't know, I guess nylon material with a little bit of um, knitting or whatever it's called. Uh, it looks nice, I'll give it that, it definitely looks nice. Um, although I already mentioned the quality is garbage. I fit a 27 inch monitor, a 24 inch monitor, and my laptop monitor which is 15.6 inches, all here, and it fits, um, although it's squishy, but it fits. So that is that. Now there are little uh, two compartments here, you can actually adjust them depending on what you like. Um, there is adjustable pieces over there, I don't know if you can see. Um, and in here there are... Uh, there are, you know, two, two compartments. Now, on this side, the way that these work, by the way, is that you push them all the way up, and they click, and then they click again. Uh, the mechanism, the way it works, is you'll see it when you put it together. But um, I was able to fit a plastic drawers in here. That was actually very nice. Um, things that I don't use that often, that fits in here. And this, this is pretty good quality. This side is actually very nice. However, this side, um, it, it, that actually just fell off right now. That's hilarious, while I'm doing the review. It actually just broke on me. Here are the screws, and here's where it's supposed to go. Look what happened. Um, it's all pressed wood, so it actually fell apart on me. Um, you can see it up in there. Yeah, so it's pretty junky. The desk is pretty junky. There are two shelves here, um, and that's actually kind of nice. More space, obviously, I like space. And there is, um, I showed you the cutouts over here a little bit clearer. I put this in the wrong way. This is the wrong way. This should be backwards. Although it still worked out, you have to nail the uh, this this cardboard onto the wood. Uh, it's a two-person job, um, this desk building. Now let's turn to um, the last part of this desk, which is the drawers. Um, this drawer is fine. I like it. It's a, it's a long drawer. It has a lot of space. Keep spare bags in here. Um, this drawer goes deep. This is where the computer is supposed to be. There's a hole in the back of it. I don't know if you can see. Um, by the way, the under part of this desk, it has one latch over there, and these two pieces latch into each other. So, yeah, you're going to need that. Um, I'm just letting you know, just showing you. This came broken, by the way. This came broken off, which is actually very sad, but whatever. And, uh, the other side. Um, it was short enough that I was able to fit this Office Depot uh, thing in it. A lot. It has a lot of compartments over here. It's actually very nice. And a drawer. This drawer is a good drawer, good for files or whatever. 
This door is broken. It keeps on breaking. It keeps on falling off the track. I've only had this for three months, remember, and I'm, I'm, I don't have any kids. So, you know, this is pretty bad. I don't break things this quickly. That's actually off the track right now. Just put it back on the track. Now it's off this track. Now I see what the problem is. It just, it's not wide enough for both tracks. Isn't that sad? It just, it just, it's not built well. Um, this has its own problems. It doesn't have any problems with falling off the track, but it has this weird thing on it. I don't know what the deal is. Um, you're meant to like slide it back and forth. I honestly don't know. I guess it's for files. This is like a filing cabinet, built-in filing cabinet. It's kind of cool. Um, I don't use it for files because all my files are on the computer. Okay. And it doesn't close all the way because the top one is messed up. That's just that's the, all there is to it. Um, would I recommend this desk to a friend? If they got it for free, I'd recommend they keep it. Um, if they if they want to spend money on it, I would tell them not more than 150 bucks. You can get better things on Craigslist. You get better things just about anywhere else. Um, I'm sorry, but I actually have two other um, Magellan products, uh, Real Space products. This chair, it's really not a bad chair at all. I like this chair a lot. It's from Real Space. Nothing wrong with it. Um, nice and cushy. And, you know, regular folding chair. They probably have a different company making it for them. But uh, quality product. I don't know how much it costs. Um, I actually bought it on Amazon and it came from Office Depot, believe it or not, which is, I think, Real Space's company is Office Depot. Also, this table outside. No, it's not that clear. Small table. Um, actually came broken a little bit also. But yeah, it is what it is. So, um, thanks for watching. I hope this helped you. And I hope this gave you some, gave you some perspective on the product. Um, have a good one.